I have to take this call? Yes, sir. The telegraph. What's wrong? What's wrong? Is it dead? I'm sorry, it bit Titan in the face. You need to send me photos of it. Calm down, it's gonna be okay. Send me photos of it right now. Okay, I'm sending Logan over on the buggy. Bye. Hey Siri, call Logan Boyle. That my dogs are playing tug of war with a snake and it's biting them and stuff. It could be venomous. It's okay, Maddie. It's okay. It's okay. It's all right. Hey, dear God, call Logan Boyle. Is he driving back here? Yes, Keep I talking said. to him. Keep talking to him. Hey man, my wife just called me, she's crying like crazy. I'm hoping my dogs aren't getting bit in the face by a venomous snake and fixing to die. My poor wife, she's got, the, got a three week old newborn and she's just like, I can't stop them. Titan, Titan. Come here young man, come here. Titan, now has he been bit? This is Wild West Airsoft episode six, and that's not the only thing that goes sideways in this episode. I created the world's largest Wild West Airsoft roleplay event at my field, Balahack, and so far, this thing is a blast. <laughs> we have good times here. We simply create the environment with some objectives for people to accomplish, and the players bring it to life. You can never predict what's going to happen next. <laughs> it's like the Wild West out here. I've already shown you the whole first day and the start of the second day. Now I've done some things. Yeehaw! Some things that I'm not proud of. And others that I am. Like losing this duel to Jet Desert Fox. And defending my boy Doug. Hey, sir, I'll give you a dollar and not heal that man. We have tons of money in the bank, a bunch of land deeds, accomplished nine out of the 11 achievements to get the victory oh, wow. coin, and we're almost there. Now this Pinkerton is asking me to help out the mayor, who my daughter and I are possibly planning on assassinating. I always do the right thing. And you can count on me to do the right thing. Now he's trying to have me show my cards about what I think about the woman and her snake oil and the mayor in his potentially poisoned moonshine. I'm not going to fall into anything. Because she's accusing him of poisoning the moonshine. And he says he's got some kind of proof on her about some farce snake oil. And he's really trying to push me for who I'm going to vote for or where he can find some moonshine. Do you know where I can find some? No. Any idea? I'm like, look, man, I'm innocent. You're trying to get me to talk right in front of the sheriff? I don't think so. Honestly, the only ones I've seen was at the mayor's office itself. Okay, that's, that's all I need. All right. Hey, my love. My wife's letting me know that my daughter is ready to play and that she brought me a cold coffee. Okay, awesome, awesome, perfect time. And I'll, I'll swing back and get her. I love you. Mwah. Love of my life is bringing me coffee. Kristen is my best friend. She makes me laugh, funniest girl I know, and I'm deeply and madly in love with her. Howdy, sir. Howdy. You're so sweet, I just got a cavity. <laughs> you know what? It says a lot coming from the candy man. The candy man. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> I heard your cousin is about to arrive in these parts. Might as well pick her up before we go find out stuff about gold. Oh, Doug did the whole thing? You give me $20 and I will have you put on that land deed with them as one of the owners. You guys all good? All good. Were you recognized for that achievement? Uh, I have been already. It's helping the lady out. Oh, okay. Wonderful. Wonderful. Thank you very much. Pleasure doing business with you. Thank you. We sold two land deeds to that group for a lot of money. Awesome. You know what we got in mind? You want me to tell me? Yeah. $2,769. $69. Jet and Smokely are still wanted. Good old Jethro. I got it. You know what? Let's go find my daughter real quick. Bounty going up. No. <laughs> they got me. He turned on you quick. All right. Grab my daughter, hit the gold miner, and then the gambler, and we get the victory coin. Looks like six real men. Howdy, partner. Howdy. Nice piece of gold y'all got. Thank you. 
<laughs> we're good, we're good. We still have one gold bar, right? Oh, we sold all of them. All of them? Oh, we did. You're right, we did. No, no. So oh. We still have a gold bar. We gotta save it. Oh, yeah. We made a couple thousand dollars selling the other ones. <sighs> There's something one? so satisfying about how that looks. I know. Do we have another one? That's it. We sold the other two to also... Wait, I'm trying to remember. Did I pick up those lots or did I leave them on the table when someone came up for the town? No. 277. 277 A, B, and C. This is over by uh, Train Stop. Hey, it's my daughter Madison. Well, isn't it Bodie Anderson? You know what your the problem is you got a picture on that wall down there so i heard gotta, about yeah. that yeah no i didn't i didn't know they were actually putting my picture up Wait, you want it? small world uh, yeah, you it's want it. it's a confusion supposedly for 50 dollars. and i just made up the 50 dollar thing i was just getting my daughter here i'm christopher eric good to, i'm america good to meet you man thank you Appreciate good to meet you, you. good to meet you yeah. and bodie I met you earlier you gonna take him in and get some money for him or what Sir, I'm not going to allow that to happen. <laughs> but what I might do is allow my own posse to take me in. <laughs> actually, that's a good idea. Actually, why don't Madison? <laughs> why don't you guys join me and escort me in? Does it say like want to dead or alive or just it says for? There's a bill next to you. Yeah, there's a bill. I didn't pay attention. How about I knew you were out here because How about you all escort me that way, and I will say. These clients of mine, <laughs> these acquaintances were so kind as to inform me because that way we can get my picture off that wall. <laughs> and we don't have to shoot yourself. you and you don't have to shoot me. <laughs> to be honest, I feel like it's just going to go right back up. I, I hope not. We have two more achievements, but we're waiting on three. Matt here. Oh, you have three. Once we're settled in there and if my name can get off off that wall we got to go all the way to the north to the gold miner oh my goodness there's less than 45 minutes till the election it takes some time and some background planning yes i would prefer to go clear myself with the office of the of the sheriff you turn yourself in uh no sir these people are because i know about the confusion about it yeah i want you to know that i am obliging the sheriff's wishes you know I'm law-abiding. Yo, that was the Pinkerton, and I'm pretty sure they were about to shoot me and then bring me in. I can't adequately express the tension that I'm feeling right now. Like, what if I'm going to serve jail time or be shamed? Hey, 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 bring me right through this door. You and you and Bodhi be like, hey, he has come with us. Please, before other people get me. Here he How you doing? The Andersons here Make a time, fellas. kindly informed me that I had an invitation to see you, and I obliged. So we just have some questions. Did you indeed point some bug hunting folk into the corner of the forest and then shoot them while their back is turned? Hey guys, there's some, uh, I think there's some big ants over by this tree. No, we're waiting for the train. We desperately need to go on the train and, so that we can go to the... Uh, Town and get some water. But yee haw! Right there. Oh, now why'd you guys gotta open fire on us like that? No. Okay, a whole group of plaid shirts came up and said, You specifically showed them where to find bugs, and when they were searching for the bugs, you shot them mm. and attempted to rob them. They shot at us. They shot at us. Sir, do you have any money on you? We're just trying to buy a train ticket. Uh, Sir, do you have any money on that? No, I miss you. None? I got five on uh, we're just trying to we're just trying to get a train ticket and these fellers here open fire on us. Hey, hey, come on, your money. I was like, just let's chill out, you know what I mean? We were waiting at the train stop and I was like, guys, there's some ants right here. Because they were looking at, I was like, what are you playing a dynamite? I'm like, there's some ants right here. We're waiting at the train stop and then <laughs> These poor dudes have to head back to spawn. God bless you, gentlemen. Hope you learned a lesson. Just don't open fire on us next time for no reason. Got that right. 
We did, however, win the battle. <laughs> That's probably why they were a little uh, upset about it. So, sounds like mistaken identity. And uh, if you want to put them up, if you want to put them up, pull, th pull them out of the lineup. Yeah, you got some you know cash on like? you. Yeah. How, who brought you in? I want to say one of them was literally peeking in the door. Who, who just brought you in? These two brought him in. These two brought me in, and I obliged. There's an yeah. $850 bounty on his head. <laughs> well, they did it. Because otherwise, I was going to run until I could get a private meeting with you. Because I don't want to show up here unless you understood yeah. I'm law abiding. I had, uh, I had suspicions that it wasn't all what they said. You know me, man. They were a little too eager. <sighs> Look, I'm not a bad person. My role play character might be questionable. I don't know. Vote now. Am I a bad person? C7 Viper, forgive me. Did you just get $850? Yeah, man, that was the easiest money I made. I'm going home. Well, no, you know, I'm I just want to say, because of my compliance, <laughs> I feel like I wouldn't mind taking a cut. Like, you know, $100 maybe? Do you hear him? What do you think? That's up to you. I'd say the 50. I'd say give me the That's fair. Hey, I'll, I'll take the 50. <laughs> it's easy. That's some good money. That's some good money right there. It was originally only 50. I don't know where the 800 came from. I have no well, idea. I'm out of here before it changes. And um, it's not going to change. Where did the 800 come from? Doug. Uh, you brought it from the bank. <laughs> I think Congratulations. We're out of here. See you. No. Thank you. What a Congrats, nice transaction. Guys. I appreciate it, man. Thanks. And it's always good when the truth, you know, I agree, wins. Yeah, we don't uh, just throw you in the stocks for nothing. Appreciate that. Doug tells me he overheard some guys that are about to shoot us when we exit. Uh, Mr. Sheriff, I'm so sorry. Urgent. Yeah, you have an urgent. Can you tell him? Out of here? Yeah. You want to go out the front? I would like to go to the back. I'm just, we want you to know we're not doing nothing. So. We're we just want you to know, uh, even in hindsight. Yeah, let's walk through the hey, bank. sir, can you follow me? I can't put this one up yet. What is it? What is it? The one you well, just told Dan to put up. What is it? Fancy meeting you here. Oh, howdy. Did oh, yeah. you, are you guys already cleared up? Huh? You guys are good. Georgia, we we're going to give them their coin now. Jet and Lena uh, are back. Nice. Can we also oh, give you one just to, survived uh, long enough. Yeah, also this, give man, one for... this man also helped us survive. He yeah. will be entitled to a bounty. Howdy. All right, Madison, can you provide security back here? Anyone that cat tries to come in and shoot us, you shoot them. Do crazy stuff. There's a group of people on the other side of that building that are just trying to kill us. You got a bounty on you. Is that true? No, nope, already been taken off, and oh someone got eight hundred and fifty dollars. Uh, I was like, I wish I knew about that. I myself in. Yeah, there was some confusion with it. All right. This guy is desperately trying to get on a land deed. He also randomly created this song. Out here at the town of Valley, I got no friends when I'm getting stabbed in the back. I got no money, no gold, no shine. All I know is it's the wild, it's the wild. Not to die, do your best. Yeah, so that was okay. Oh, that's not fish. Yeah, sure is. Oh, what is this? So I'm calling Chris Books. That looks fancy to me. <laughs> I'm just curious as to how much money you'll offer to get your name on a land deed. Here, you count that, and we'll get up in a short bit if you want to get some land. Oh, All right. What's the price range you looking for? A lot. It's crazy in this game how money begets more money. We need to do the gold mine, but we need Ian. Yeah. There's a lot of people out there. Oh, there's the mayor. They don't want to buy a door. The sheriff's office wants to buy a door. All right, cool. Ian's here. Let's grab a drink and head to the gold mine. That's a misinformation right there. Good sir. Howdy. Let's just go do the thing. Official state business. Oh my goodness. Ours under health inspection currently. Water 
Don't mind the extra crunchy roads. They're up. Can I have a root beer? I suppose so. Huh? I suppose so. Whatever that ice. Slim is running for mayor. More taxes, no train, and keep the town wet. That's a terrible campaign statement. Root beer said, sir? Oh, snap. It's the woman running for mayor. There is a heavy dog. This is for you to thank you. And also, all drinks for the day are on the woman. Sir? All drinks for the day are on the woman! All drinks for the day are on the woman! Oh, my goodness. I don't care if I hear bears looking for you. Well, it's probably bad time for that health inspection that I spoke. I've never felt so much power in one place at the same right. time. You should come out and vote. Be part of that power. Oh, I'll be voting. Awkward. Where's a... Give me some cream soda, sir. Yeah, give Thank me... you. Give me a cream soda. Does anybody else want a drink? It's on the mayor. Last chance on the drink. woman, according to this dollar. That, we might want to check that dollar. That's fake. <laughs> <laughs> what a strange power struggle. Howdy. Well, well, well. What are you doing? You're paying yourself, basically. We're stuck. Mm. <laughs> My mind, man. I'm like looking at you. I'm like, hey, hey, have you seen Doug? <laughs> Someone with a rifle on the right. I love it. You gotta like actually watch out for rifles. Someone with a re revolver over a hundred feet away. It's like, man. Well, this is the farthest north we've been. Now we're heading to the north. Never been north. I'm going to see the uh, gold miner. Try to get the prospector achievement. After that, it's just gambler for me. These folk need uh, fishermen? Yep. Yeah. I don't need fishermen. Oh, I do need it. I haven't get collected it from them. At the very end of the first day, I caught a fish. Oh yeah, baby! Oh yeah, and he is here to witness the glory. Ha ha. Ha 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 ha. Ha ha ha. Oh. Oh. Ha ha ha. I'm gonna cool that puddle down for it. Oh, that's so, so nice. I know. I'm gonna leave my coffee here and pick it up on the way back. Look at this. No one's coming back here. Oh, there is someone back here. How you doing? Hey. Getting your steps in? Yeah. Okay, have you seen a right. fellow with a pink cowboy hat around? I have not. I actually think I saw him actually down there. Thank you very much. Is the prospector back here? Gold miner? We were here looking for him. Oh, and you haven't seen him? Yeah. All right, well, thank you. Yeah. Gentlemen, have a good one. Yeah, something's not right about those guys. They had their hands on the ground. Oh, I know. That's why I lied. I was like slowly, quietly uh, never, cocking back both of my hammers. I never saw anybody with the pink hat, so I'm just saying. Yeah, I didn't see anybody. I never seen a person in my life. I'm like, what is? I never seen nobody. I wonder what Jen and Lee are doing right now. I wonder how hard it will be to get the prospector achievement. I wonder what the basic unit of an organism is. It's a cell. You were wrong. Even if you got it right, you were wrong. This is what I should do. An entire game, just talk to the camera and just don't even play airsoft. Turn my camera off because nature called and then this series of unfortunate events happens. Almost to the gold mine, I had to use the restroom so I tried to find an outhouse in the woods. And then these three guys, I'm like, I'm trying to use the restroom and now they're waited up for me. So I need to get away from them. I do not want to lose this gold bar. This ain't good. They're just waiting for me. And I have the swamp. And I got my genuine python shoes. Howdy. I said howdy. No, I was looking for some gold. Why did I say that? I have a giant gold bar worth like 1500 bucks on me. I feel a little suspect by the way y'all stopped. Y'all fixing to shoot me? You sure about that? Are you sure about that? All right. 
I was like, maybe they'll be gone by the time I finish up. My gut tells me I shouldn't trust them and I should shoot them when I have the chance. Yeah, you gotta get a picture with them, man. So I was like, I'll just wait back here as long as I need to before y'all pass. <laughs> I'm a little disappointed that my posse didn't uh, come looking for me. <laughs> yeah. I was like, I'm gonna be a dead man. Uh, yeah, no, we're not fixing to shoot yet. We just wanted a picture with you. Yeah, yeah, let's do it. How are we gonna do it? Take turns or? We could selfie. I've got a long arm. All right. See if we can get all of us in here. <laughs> you know what I mean? Oh, uh, if you could do it with my phone too. Thank Absolutely. you very much. My cousin would be. You later. Awesome. I should do it now, but I don't have the heart. Thank you so All right. Much. Thank you, gentlemen. You having fun? Yeah. yeah I'm having Excellent. Excellent. Lots of fun. Did you guys get the perfect specter? <laughs> ah. All right. What you got on you? <laughs> oh, okay. I got some stuff. Well, I was not that. Ah. You got to ask me what I got. I got some gameplay items. I got some money. You have a bandage? I do not have a bandage. What money you got? I got probably a good amount of money. I got a, I got a hundred dollars. Probably, yeah, at least. And that's the amount. Ah, I'm hurting. <sighs> Fifty. Sixty. <laughs> Seventy. No, I'm not. That's seventy-five. It'll take longer to get the rest. We have got a hostage. Put it away. <laughs> Come on, Doug and Ian, shoot these dudes. Put Where's, it away. Where's the money? Stay back there, put it away, or we will kill him. You already kind of killed me. Oh, you want to trade that back for a straight hundred? No. Nah, oh, okay. Just give us that and we'll leave. Well, better stay I can't back. give you more than a hundred. No, Here's another not. six. All right, boys, let's go. Okay. I was literally, literally about to shoot them. That didn't work out for me. I should have, I thought, you know, oh, here in the picture, you guys hold the camera, let's do it one at a time. Shoot both, hold them, and then I take selfies with them. That's what I should have done. I'm pretty, you know what? You know what, Ian, Doug, and Madison? I'm pretty disappointed right now, and yet they gotta ask, like, do you have this, do you have that? Maybe it was wrong, maybe I should have just straight up been like, I have a giant gold bar. Thank God, here comes Doug. I'm dead. How much did they take? $100. I'm just so lucky they didn't ask for gold. I, I, I literally walk to use the restroom when I see the group coming. So I walk further away and they keep walking, they keep walking. I'm like, I'm just using the restroom. So I go to the restroom and I look back and they're just hiding. And then they ask for a picture. And I'm like, all right, we can take a picture. I was going to shoot them after the picture. And the second he's like, thank you, sir. Boom. Yep. Let's go. Oh my gosh, both of my guns. There's also one right behind us. Yep. I got it, I got it. Same in the whole thing. Hey, we're cool. Someone just robbed a man while he was using an outhouse. I was that man who was using the outhouse who got robbed. Oh no, these are the bug guys. And there's mud in my barrel. There's three folk back there that just robbed me if you guys want to shoot someone. I'm just saying. Someone shot Maddie and Ian. Nope. Nope. Hey. You got, is that man with you guys? Well, you got to hold off on this. Nothing to do with you. You're good. Oh, this ain't going to turn out well. We're cool. Y'all stay back. I've got nothing to do with your group. I'm just defending my daughter and my nephew. I'll let you come heal him in a second. Ah! God. Well, that didn't work, but I wasn't about to let someone rob my daughter and nephew. That was scary. What money do you have, my friend? I shouldn't have done it. I, I had at least $100. Oh. Is that what you're going? That is. Let me find it. Six, oh, thank goodness. Seven, this is revenge. Eight. This is revenge. Revenge. You don't remember no. us, but we remember you. <laughs> <laughs> Yesterday, we were getting bugs. <laughs> and you told us. 
Go look for bugs over there. And then you shot us and out of you nowhere. Shot us. You shot us out of nowhere. I showed you where the ants were. Yeah. And you shot he us remembers. for no reason. No reason. I know I have a hundred dollar bill on me. I just had it when I just got robbed of a hundred dollars. Ain't even my pouch. Oh, thank you. Wait, he's got. I'm. Well, I'll give him the hundred dollars. I said I would. Once okay. I find it. If you insist, I'll wait. <laughs> no, no, no. You can heal me up. I'll still give him the hundred dollars. Okay, that's ones. 20, One, 21, 22, 23, 24, Beautiful. five, Glad you're doing business with seven, <laughs> eight, as long as it's not the golden bar. 11, 12, that's for Cody. Yeah. There you go. That for you, buddy. 14, 20, 21, 22, 23, 6, 27, 28, 29, 30. All right. Yeah, I was with that group, man. We squared up now. We squared part. We squared up. All right, thank you. I got mud in this barrel. Look at that. Oh yeah. These hey, I'm gonna try to shoot the mud out. Hey. All right. That's nice. Just hit. My gun's just broke. Down on that. You got some. You two, all right? All right. You all right? You good? Did they rob you? No. They took a hundred dollars off me. We need to go for the the coin. Hey man, what we've been doing, my group. Right now, I joined up with them. We just put our money right in the bank, and we go about and do our thing. I suggest you do that. No, we. I've got like three grand in the bank. Oh. And like seven land deeds. You just problem used was to wrap up tobacco in. <laughs> the problem was, I'm just trying to get this objective done, and I had just about two hundred dollars on me. And in five minutes, I had, I was looted twice for all of that. So now I have like four dollars on me. There we go, finally made it back to the gold miner. <sighs> gold miner around? Yeah. Anybody talking to him? Yep. Yeah, he's yeah, bringing us something. Oh, okay, okay. In the middle of a transaction. Please, in the shade. I have business over here, gentlemen. Please. You know what we need? Because that would allow it in the event. A crank gatling gun. That would be sick. So what we do is we have like a little wagon that we pull around, right? We pull it around and the second there's a bad situation, rip a cloth off of it and people have custom made them. It doesn't exist as like a, guys, that gold bar, I was so scared. This guy is one of the nicest guys ever. And now I only have like $3 on me. Invest, all right. You don't got to do that. That's a hundred dollar bill. You don't got to do that, but I, I appreciate you, I've it. I've seen your videos. I mean, you get in tough spots like this. Oh, it's all good. Sure. I'm just glad that now that all my money's been looted, I don't got much to loot anymore. <laughs> nothing to loot, nothing to lose. All right. We want to talk to that gold miner. And if he comes up with a complex quest, he'll never be a role player again, as long as he lives. <laughs> Sir, there's a line. You're good, you're good. Yeah, we made it all the way back here. I'm not messing around. Uh, the election's in eight minutes. Oh, really? Yeah. It's already firing up. Oh, man. So it's probably going to be delayed. I'll tell you what. I'm going to try to do this thing. We're going to try to do the thing. We're going to see. Oh, you're fine, sir. Where do y'all hail from? How you doing? Swamp. How we doing, sir? I've been in these parts for a few years. How we doing? How we doing? Oh, I'm so sorry, ma'am. I did not recognize you. How are you? <laughs> Good. Thank you. I'm so glad that you traveled so far. It has been a very treacherous day and a very hot day. Yeah. How may I help y'all? Well, sir, we were looking to help you, actually. Help me? In what way, no, sir? We worked for almost two days and scarcely held on to something. I know that you like collecting the rough stuff. I don't know if you like receiving what is refined. But well, we have something large and heavy that's refined and there's an election about to happen in the town that we got to make it back to you. And I yes, didn't sir. know if you would appreciate this thing that's large and heavy. Well, if it's of maybe a good quality, I may be able to uh, ascertain such a thing. Okay. Lucille, if you will not stop choking me, darling, <laughs> I tell you, I'm going to town and then you will be gone. I will get a divorce of you. I have to take this call? Yes, sir. The telegraph What's wrong? What's wrong? 
Is it dead? I'm sorry, it bit Titan in the face? You need to send me photos of it. Calm down, it's gonna be okay. Send me photos of it right now. Okay, I'm sending Logan over on the buggy, bye. Hey Siri, call Logan Boyle. The, my dogs are playing tug of war yeah, with yeah, a yeah, snake yeah. and it's biting them and stuff. It could oh. be venomous. It's okay, Maddie. It's okay. It's okay. It's all right. Hey, dear God, call Logan Boyle. Is he driving back here? Yes, Keep talking should. to him. Keep talking to him. Hey man, my wife just called me. She's crying like crazy. My dogs are playing tug of war with possibly a venomous snake and it keeps biting them and she doesn't know what to okay. do. Um, hey guys, I'll see, I'll see you back there. If a coin comes of it, get it for me. I gotta save my dogs. I'm hoping my dogs aren't getting bit in the face by a venomous snake and fixing to die. Slow and smooth, smooth as fast. You know what I mean? My poor wife, she's got, the, got a three week old newborn and she's just like, I can't stop them. Three dogs, all of which were biting the snake and one of which was trying to bite my wife to protect her when she drew near. Titan! Titan! Come here, young man. Come here. Titan. Now, has he been bit? Titan. I mean, it looks like a red belly, so... It, it does. I just, I need him gone from it before I flip it over to confirm it's a red belly. Hey, sit! Titan, sit! 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 Good boy. Good boy. Is the baby safe in the other room? No, sir. I mean, it looks like a red belly. Yeah, it does. Yep, it's just a red belly. Dang, your dogs are vicious. All is good in the hood, though. That's good. So, babe, I love you. You go in. Dude, where's Ed when you need him? He looks like Indiana Jones right now. Babe, it's outside of the fence. I'll deal with it later. Yeah, just, I love you. Stay inside. I'm so sorry you went through that. I feel so bad that happened, especially because my dog Thanos was bit by a copperhead about a year before. And Thanos, who I love greatly, is no longer with us. I had to put him down about a week ago because he developed cancer incredibly quickly and uh, I buried him. What's this crazy futuristic vehicle I'm on? I don't know. Well, what I know now is I arrived just in time for the election. Gather more people. Thank you. Yep. My wife just called me and said our three dogs are playing tug of war with a copperhead and it's striking them in the face over and over. <laughs> it wasn't a copperhead, but it sure looked like one. So it was non-venomous. Ugh. Well, I just fast traveled here. It was non-venomous. I can't believe you brought that back. Thank you. How are the dogs? They're fine. It was non-venomous, Maddie. It's okay. All the dogs are fine. Like what happened? They got bit, but it was non-venomous, so there were no fangs. It was just striking them in the face overnight. Our dogs started playing. They're fine. It doesn't hurt them. They don't have snakes without fangs. Don't have teeth that hurt. It just feels like you know. So like what happened though? Mommy looked out. The dogs were playing tug of war with the snake, trying to rip it apart, defend the family, and the snake keeps biting them, you know, striking at them. Did he, then he wanted it, he was cool with it. She also gave her a golden bill, a golden $20. <gasps> Maddie, you got a golden $20 bill? Yeah, I got one. Good job, baby. Wait, you got a good? Yeah, it's awesome, I don't, like, that can be worth boom, a prospect or achievement. All right, finally, now that I've got Prospector, I've got 10 achievement coins and I only need the Gambler. But we're gonna go up during the election so that we're safe. So, Good to see you in this town again. Well, I, well, I decided I don't care about his opinion, so. Ladies and gentlemen of the town! I don't know. Hello! I hope we're gonna go up there so that we can get some perspective and not die. Buddy Rose! Why are you back in my town? 
Ladies and gentlemen, I know there has been several accusations upon myself from a few other less than reputable people in this town. Sheriff. <laughs> that I'm selling some illegal alcoholic beverages. And it tastes pretty good, too. Thank you. Now, there have also been a few accusations that that said alcohol has been poisoned. I assure you that I will drink that here, right here in front of you. Wait, we have one test we can do. We have two, one from you and the general store. Who wants to see a test done? Yeah. Hey, 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 hey. This election is awesome and turns into a bunch of action. And if you want to win this Smoke Wagons Legends revolver signed by me, like the video, subscribe, and comment how much money was in my bank account. Thank you so much for watching this content. I like telling all the story and whatever you do in life, stay safe, enjoy it. Be creative and peace.